Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Pastiche of Skin. It is very nice to have you here. Thank you very much for watching. As you can see, we have a little bit more news. Final Fantasy XV's multiplayer beta is now available to be downloaded in the Hong Kong store, but specifically only if you have a copy of the game with the season pass for the English, Korean, or Chinese versions. Now, this isn't to say that you should go out and buy that right now. This beta is coming worldwide. It just happens to be that it's up available on the Hong Kong store. But we do have a little bit of information that actually is related to it in the Hong Kong store that's going to apply to absolutely everybody. So it's available from August 3rd to August 9th and requires you to have PAS Plus and the Season Pass for Final Fantasy XV to be able to play. Now, uh, the details it writes down is, This close online test is an exclusive preview that allows you to experience select elements from the upcoming multiplayer expansion, create your own avatars, then lead them on multiplayer quests with up to three other players to bring the light back to the Lucius. Many exciting new features await you in the release version, an engaging story, an expanded field of play, more quests, and more playable characters, including Noctis and his friends. So this is what I thought would happen whenever I was first playing Final Fantasy XV. You can see me talking about it on the actual like, videos if you hit the card button and go and see the ones that I played of the game. This is Final Fantasy XV as a platform. Final Fantasy as a platform makes more sense than ever before where they can literally just kind of keep expanding the lore, expanding the world, especially whenever they've been trying to go in the, uh, the like, mm, sequelization direction with, from 5th, 13 onwards. With Final Fantasy XV and the episodes they've added on to it, they've extended its life of one game and its play at reu by reusing assets and doing so with a multiplayer expansion. It's going to essentially give people the opportunity to go off in mini-adventures with three or four of their friends, take photographs, enjoy bits and pieces of the, uh, the world, and actually make a, a fun environment of trying to test a couple of things against each other to see how easy it is to beat a bunch of monsters. And they're, all they need to do is just keep adding monsters and adding difficulties and adding monsters and adding difficulties, and people will repeat and repeat and repeat those missions as they go along. It feels very much like uh, whenever I used to play Fantasy Star Universe or uh, any real... Uh, early stage RPG where it was literally, you'd fight the same bosses just with an EX or S rank mission version that you had to go through afterwards. And I don't think that's a bad thing. Uh, games like God Eater, Rage Burst, and uh, trying to think of other games that actually have used that same format, uh, so, uh, took it in as well, I suppose, have these kind of like uh, arena maps that you're going to be repeating over and over again. And I think that's going to go really well for Final Fantasy XV because it, it'll drag me back. I'll give it a try at least. Even though I never finished Final Fantasy XV, the full story, I need to go back and play that. But um, the, this expansion, this multiplayer episode has me a little bit hyped and I will pro I'm will. i going to go and buy a season pass now to actually be able to take part in it. And if you want to take part in it, I hope you actually download it and uh, check out the videos I'll be doing between August 3rd and August 9th to actually see if it's worthwhile. And um, if, you're, if you appreciate me giving you this information, uh, give me a thumbs up on the video. If you didn't like it, or you actually already knew about all this information, give me a thumbs down. That's absolutely fine. And if you really like to hear more, then you can always hit the subscribe button that's sitting up there. If you don't do the subscribe thing, completely understand. All you have to do is remember the name, Pastiche of Skin. It's right down there. Memorize it. Type it into Google every once in a while. You'll come and find me. I'm not trying to hide. So thank you very much for watching. And oh, wait, hang on. The YouTube thing. And... Bam! If you actually enjoyed this video, there's actually a series of videos up here that'll be related to it. It'll be the Final Fantasy 15 playlist of me playing through the game. Over on the far side will be the most recent upload on the channel. And right over here will be a video for you! Based on your user statistics and all the things you do on YouTube and the things you like and watch and see, it will be a video that you will enjoy based on what I make. So thank you very much for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye!